So we're back in Milwaukee. This is about the third summer that we've been here. We're at the Wisconsin State Fair RV Park, which is actually pretty nice. It's basically, you know, your RV park where it's a concrete parking lot, but you've got full hookup. Um, and the beauty of this is that it is centrally located. So anywhere you want to go, it's pretty much right there. So we're, we're actually taking one of our daily walks through yeah. the park right now. And uh, Mark is kind of like voicing how he feels about this place. How do you feel, Mark? Well, I, I was thinking that, uh, first of all, I was thinking that you should, probably shouldn't be holding on to me because I think I'm shaking your camera. No, you're steady me. Oh. I'm keeping you close. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> you're uh, my gimbal. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm Sue's gimbal. You know, just because we grew up and we lived in Milwaukee when we finally left on our journey, when we come back here, we think people aren't interested in it. And all of a sudden, the the, the light went on and we're, we're like, hey, this is a great place. Yeah. Uh, even though it's just a concrete parking lot with a full hookup, it is literally in the heart of Milwaukee. And it's super cheap. I mean, we, we're paying, uh, I think... Uh, uh, it's about 800 during the summer, their high season, yeah. and September on, it's about 650 yeah, per some, month. Something like that. That, that it, includes your electric. Yeah. That's your monthly fee. Yeah, so it, good. if you look at the, the, the things to do in Milwaukee, you could time it with some of the festivals. It gets a little dicey in this particular park during the... Uh, uh, state fair state fairgrounds because this actually is the state fair park and it's really in place for all of the people that come to run the state fair so all of the people that run the rides and all the concessions and everything they come and they actually live here so they displace people like us and we understand that but like uh, during some of the Harley fests and during uh, summer fest if you're smart enough to book the uh, appropriate time you will get in. That's true. So, uh, and there, there's all kinds of things happening in Milwaukee. There's summer fest yeah. early in the summer. There's the Miller Brewery. There's Brewers Games. Tons of different parks. The, the zoo is phenomenal. A lot of things to do here in Milwaukee. Right, and we're a little late in the season this year. We'll do our best to throw a couple things in there. Uh, yeah, it, we're like, yeah. what is it, August 30th today. So we, we missed kind of the, the summer rush, but it's still beautiful. It's warm. We're in shorts. Yep, and we're going to go bike riding tonight on our Waukesha bike ride. And we'll we'll but give like you a said, taste of what it is. Wait till we get our electric bike. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's go. We're getting ready for another fun time in Milwaukee. One of the favorite things that we used to do with our group of friends is we would take a bike ride from um, from our house. Right now it's from Wisconsin State Fair. And there's uh, the Hank Aaron bike trail right outside of our, our park here. We hop on the bike and we head out to Waukesha. So Waukesha is um, boy, I don't know how many miles. I'll let you know. But out in Waukesha, downtown Waukesha, and every Friday during the summer, they close it down. They have bands everywhere. So we dance. We meet our friends. We're into swing dancing. Then after that, we go eat. And then like 11 o'clock, midnight, we end up riding back. That is the best part. You can see Mark has our bikes all lined up and tires are inflated and we're ready to go just waiting on mark as you can see it's just me again waiting on mark gotta load this is it we're off on your left buddy <laughs> So it may look like I'm going about 16 miles per hour, 17 miles per hour. I'm really not that fast. Somehow my odometer got set funny, so I'm on kilometers, but heck, I'm gonna leave it. I feel fast. One of the things that we really like about this trail is that while it's pretty level, 
but also it's got so much scenery that we go past and sometimes you actually forget we're going right through the city. Here we are, we're on the Oak Leaf Trail. We're gonna take a left now. Oops, that would be the other left. I love riding through the woods like this. So when we come back at night, it's gonna be pitch dark. We have a lot of lights on for our bikes and uh, that's the magical part. And I think we're in a new moon. Usually if it's a full moon, it just adds to the magic. All right, so we just uh, took the Hank Aaron Trail from the RV park and we hooked up with the Oak Leaf Trail. And now we're getting on to the New Berlin Trail. And here comes Mark. Yep, walking it up. I had to do the same thing. Um, we had to get through the street for a bit to connect here. And uh, man, that's a steep hill. Here we are, we're heading on to the New Berlin Trail. And this is actually a, a Rails to Trail trail. And from here all the way to Waukesha, it is straight and it's pretty level. Actually, there's a slight elevation going there, which makes it awesome coming back because we can just like pretty much coast for this maybe two or three miles. Here we go. So we usually end up meeting our group of friends out in Waukesha just because we're all on different schedules, leaving at different times. But every now and then, we'll hook up with somebody on the trail out there. Look who's joining us. Who is it? Why? It's oh. Andy. Hey, Andy. And Jenny okay. and Natalie just caught up to us. Hey. Excellent. Hi. Thanks for joining us. Happy All right. Apparently, it looks like the trail is closed, but it's not really true. It's only closed to most people. Ah, yeah. So we will go ahead and go around the uh, barricades, and it'll be fine. Okay, I'm documenting this. If it's illegal, we right. have it now. Okay, if we're, if we're good to know. <laughs> this was kind of unexpected, but it's after hours, they're not working, so we're all good. Waukesha Friday Night Live actually runs throughout the summer. They close down all the streets in downtown Waukesha and they have like nine different stages of live entertainment. Once we locked up our bikes, got our dancing shoes on, we caught up with the rest of the gang. Mark and I actually met swing dancing through the Jump and Jive Club run by Maureen Majeski. And that's how we met all these other swing dancers. And to our delight, actually, they enjoyed bike riding too. So when I was putting this video together, I was a little concerned about the music in the background and being dinged for using copywritten music. But we shazammed it, it didn't show up. So I'm just gonna keep talking over it and hopefully it won't affect us at all. We'll see. All right, we're done. And then when we're done with all our dancing, we get ready to ride our bikes over to one of our favorite restaurants. This is how we do it. Dance shoes off, riding shoes on. So here we are at one of our favorite spots right after the dance. It's about nine o'clock. This is uh, El Station, mm -hmm. and it's an old, uh, uh, Railroad car, station. railroad car, and you have to remember one of the things you do when you're retired, you dance and expend 30 calories, and then you consume 1,000 to replace them. <laughs> 1,000. Let's start that with a margarita. What do you say? <laughs> So here we are, we're heading back to the Wisconsin State Fair Park right now. It's after midnight. 
We left our friends at about 116th and now we're on our own. And this is the magical part. The only bad thing is that usually uh, some of the better nights are when it's a full moon. It's actually a new moon, but it's still beautiful, kind of cool, refreshing. Hard to believe it's after midnight. I'm not tired. And there's my monocle way in the back. Man, that's a bright light. That's your midnight ride. Good. Yeah. The left knee hurts. Mine does too. We're so much alike. <laughs> Has to be the dancing. Has to be. A lot of times when we're riding back, we'll actually have really balmy summer evenings. And combine that with a full moon, it's fantastic. Let's listen to the crickets. Fairgrounds. We're almost there. Here we are. Here we are. And actually, that is us. Made it home. <laughs> 